vision that has really become the core of Mantasia, that it reflects, as you put it, a positive view of sexuality for women, and it nurtures, if I get any of this wrong, you can correct it, nurtures, and they learn to discover who they are and what they want as women through their sexuality. How do you ensure that, that that experience is what a guest receives when they're there? What is like, what does the show look like? How do we make that happen? And then we'll take a clip, we'll look at a little clip. Well, uh, it's the moment a uh, guest walks in the door, they're treated with respect. Mm -hmm. That's the number one uh, mm -hmm. that we wanted to ensure. And um, we respect women's intelligence, mm -hmm. so we give them an intelligent show. Mm -hmm. And um, we want to make sure they're pampered and just very well treated. Um, they're given individual attention, um, we, you know, try and take care of all their needs. Right, and you have, I, you have a massage therapist there on hand to just, you know, and everybody loves a great massage, right? Oh, the girls love the and massage. And that's aside from the performers. I mean, there's a lot of stimulation all night. It's, uh, there's visual stimulation. There's, we try and stimulate all the senses because, well, I think that women are multidimensional mm -hmm. when it comes to their sensuality. Right. sexuality. Mm -hmm. So um, we feed them. <laughs> um, we have uh, beautiful chocolate-covered strawberries laid out on a, a gorgeous a man platter. Oh yes, so you have the human dessert the tray. Human dessert tray, which is uh, not not. I'm sure no one else has that in their show. <laughs> Anywhere. No, not yet. Not yet. <laughs> well, they heard it here. Don't do it. We'll get in trouble. Um, you two also perform with the fell. I like to call them the fellas. But um, does that set a more open tone for the women? And who are the performers? And I know all of uh, the employees are handpicked, I'm assuming, by you and the other producers. Mm -hmm. And um, and does that help to create, and how do you choose who you put in to create that ultimate experience? What is the criteria if someone were to come to you to want to mm -hmm. be part of the show? Yeah, to answer the first question, mm -hmm. us performing with the men, mm -hmm. us um, uh, emceeing and running the room and giving the women, you know, microphone greetings and directions and things from the minute that they come in the door makes the women feel very safe. It's a show mm -hmm. run by women for women and they're coming into this room a little nervous, not sure what's going to mm -hmm. happen. And once they realize that it's run by a couple of mischievous women themselves, <laughs> it gives them permission and they relax and, mm -hmm. and it becomes, I think, so much more fun for them mm -hmm. than, say, the same kind of show run by, run by men. Right. Yeah. It's a different energy. It's a very different energy. This isn't testosterone driven no. and, you know, so there's a whole other thing. Although it's great that there's mm -hmm. testosterone yeah. there. <laughs> our, our room isn't ocean of feminine energy because mm -hmm. it's large groups of women coming out for that one time, once in a lifetime chance to have a bachelorette party for this one woman. Mm -hmm. And just the energy of that, they're on a mission to have the best night of their lives. Mm -hmm. And we have an entire room full of this. Mm -hmm. And in the beginning, it's just, it's just the women and we slowly bring the men into the room. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have to choose the men really carefully because yes, we we're not just looking for the most beautiful men but also um, it's a, really about their personalities mm -hmm. also. They're beautiful, mm -hmm. absolutely, um, but they understand that they're there to meet the women's needs. Mm -hmm. They're not there on an ego trip right. for themselves. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, wonderful. We're going to um, show a little clip. It's very little, and then we're going to talk. We only have like a minute and a half after we show this clip. I'm so We could talk forever, but better yet, don't talk. Go to Mantasia and have a great time. <laughs> 